Thank you both for joining me. You may take your seats. Thank you. Your Excellency, let me begin with you. You cycled over 10 kilometers this morning from State House all the way to the UN complex. And many are wondering, with the elements, because it was raining at that time, why did you do that? Thank you so much, uh, Victoria. Thank you. Thank you so much, Victoria. Uh, so cycling has really been part of my life. I, I grew up in uh, Western Province. That was the former Western Province, now Kakamega County. So, sorry about that. Thank you so much, Victoria. So actually, we've cycled this morning about 10.8 kilometers. I grew up, I was born in Western uh, Kenya, and you know, uh, what we do in Western Kenya, in Kakamega County especially, is we, we love cycling. So growing up, uh, we had a small bicycle. My father had bought, like for my older siblings, and we kept passing it from one person to another. So I learned cycling, and uh, the passion never left me. So many years later, after I came to the city of Nairobi, I bought a bicycle also, and uh, I continued cycling. Uh, but what really happened was uh, during covid uh, 19, we realized that everybody was locked and uh, there was nothing much that was happening. So I got the community around where I lived and we started uh, a cycling community with the young people and just the neighbors. And uh, so we have been cycling from that time and uh, we called it Mama Cycling. And uh, of course, many other things followed uh, because we realized that uh, as we were cycling in the uh, streets or the roads of Kenya, we realized that. Uh, there was no cycling paths, you know, for the cyclists. We were actually sharing the road uh, with the motorists. And uh, many other times you'd be pushed off the road. And so we thought this will not just be about cycling, but at least it's good so that we can at least uh, become advocates of a just road system in Kenya. And of course, issues of environment, because you realize that uh, uh, when you cycle, there's no much emission, uh, you know, the pollution that we emit into the environment. So we thought, uh, of course, we could uh, continue cycling. And now we have a very big community, and we've just joined other many cyclists in Kenya because already there were other communities uh, cycling. Before I bring uh, Madam E.D. on, uh, let me ask you this. Your video shared a lot about your organization, Mama Doing Good. How did it all begin? Uh, Mama Doing Good uh, actually uh, began with uh, what Beatrice talked about, with, which is the Joyful Women Organization, a dream that uh, I got uh, about 25 years ago. And uh, I was in the rural areas, and I saw a woman that uh, did not have shoes, yet was very happy. And so I wondered uh, what we could do to really help this woman. And in 2009, uh, through the help of the then Poverty Eradication Commission by the government, we established Joyful Women Organization, which is a table banking program that brings together women to do table banking, like to have a, a bank on the table. And so from the, joy, uh, from the Joyful Women, we have moved on into the Mama Cycling, and now we are doing environment, and all our programs are under the Mama Doing Good. We just want to do good, Victoria. And in Mama Doing Good, we say we do it the right way. Because sometimes you may be doing good that you don't do it the right way. So that is how Mama Doing Good was established in 2021 to bring together all the programs when I was the spouse of the uh, uh, deputy president and now the first lady of the Republic of Kenya. Thank you. Thank you, Your Excellency. Uh, Madam Edie, you mentioned in your speech that we only have seven years left to achieve the commitments of the SDGs, not a long time. Uh, what do you suggest we can do to ensure that no one is left behind, and especially women? Thank you very much, uh, Victoria, for that question. I think we are less than seven years left. I remember I even calculated the number of days when I, in my closing speech during the World Urban Forum in Katowice uh, last year. I think what from the from the example that we have seen just now, from the video, and then from the uh, poet, and also from the, the life example that Betty 